Well, I went straight ahead before, so yeah. Figured it would do that again. Aw, yeah, it keeps doing that. Yes, what is person running? What am I speed dating or something? Either that or I'm failing to impress these women on a massive scale. Yeah, that was kind of bad. And... now we're in a space shuttle. In outer space. which is apparently a bat. Or... Um... Uh, no, uh... Stupid, stupid card. Or, well... I guess... More like foolish card. Let's start with the demon card. Buying and yeah, didn't really get to read it in time. Oh well, so he bought a card. <laughs> I should remember to use my own. What do you do? Devil card. What? What did it do? I don't know what it did. Apparently I made the wrong choice again, and things went badly. And... I don't know quite what happened, so we're just gonna continue on. I think we made some money because of the... Devil card and us failing. Something like that. Hmm? Okay, it's time to buy a... Building. Or I guess a house. A Rika Chan house, or, well, Rika Chan house. Senmo Gako school. Um, big dome. Sure is a big dome. And those are our choices. Small thing, smaller thing, freaking huge. We're going with the stadium because we can. It again. Looks like we're making less money. We're kind of short on detective work out here in outer space, I guess. Hmm. Ah, that's the one he got. Well, the go forward two spaces or the love card. We'll go with that. this love card do? No, oh, it's the one that gave him the option to go on a date. I think these would be the names of various people. So we have... I think that's Gomami, Ayuko, Reina, Kanoko, Fukako, Chami, Yuika, and Norie. Even for Japanese names, those are all weird. No, 
yeah, that would be this one. The girl with the most... But... Oh, we can actually look at them. Did not realize we would have the option to look at the various stats and whatnot. And, of course, the pictures. And some of them don't really look all that girly, while others are just kind of... Ugh. That does have kind of like a <laughs> Jill Valentine look. Okay, let's see if we actually hit it off with her. Looks like it's going good. Okay, I think things went well. Yeah. <laughs> How about that? I think he just chose between a go forward eight steps and go forward three steps card and took the go forward three steps card. I guess that could be strategic, but when you're that far behind, is that really the smart move? And we're almost back up to the amount of cash we had before. I think it also says something that we are this far in life, and we just went out on our first date. Whereas, in the American game of life, it's like... Okay... School, job, marriage. It, there's like, no time in between. And you're forced to get married. There is no other option. button. There we go. He actually made a good payday and is starting to have a small little bankroll saved up. Okay. Will this finally end the game? And if not, where can we go now that we've been through space? What could possibly be next? in the city, with flashing letters over various buildings. Okay, card shop. Go forward, eight, game card, macho card, which kind of sucked, and that thing, which some kind of event. I just looked up that word and now I forget what it meant. Oh, right, the end of... Oh! It's an end of century card, so maybe it will have some kind of game ending event. I think that would be nice at this point in time. Okay. What? Oh god, look at me now. I didn't even notice that, but I'm old! Plus my pancake jaw too. But what does this card do? What? Okay, I'm choosing something by roulette. I've chosen the I think that's the butch person something or other. I I um... <laughs> so... 
that's the end of century card. And he's saying the word butch or buchu over and over and over again. So that's a buchu alien. And that sure was a thing. And he found poop in the Antarctic. Japan, everybody! Eh, great, I have no cards left. What is my status? Eh, too much. We'll just... put her along now that we're old. Yeah, housing options again. Can we buy more housing? Okay, uh, secret. Tell me that says lab. Kichi. Secret base. <laughs> Secret base. Rika Chan's house. That stupid building. That, I guess that's... Let me just look up that word. Senmon. Specialty. So, specialty school. Rika Chan's house. Or a secret base. There is no doubt whatsoever. <laughs> okay. Well, he got Christmas again, so let's see what sort of pain Santa doles out this time. money. And that was it. He lost money. Unless I just was not paying attention. And now, 20 morals. Oh, I lost 20 morals. I have no morals left. Well, I'm old, so... Morals do tend to go out the window. Sort of earn that right to do whatever the hell you want and get away with it. Hmm. Now what goes on here? It's a special square that could not be passed, so... I get that money. And A course, B course, or C course. A we're taking a quiz. A course. No, oh, we're not taking a quiz, we are playing roulette. Okay. <laughs> and we freaking Raking in the dough. Hey, hey, we made it to the goal. And now we die. And we get even more for getting there first, assumedly. And then we just speedy, speedy, speed right along. And we get more money just for having another turn while he is still playing, we get more money. This seems really, really unbalanced. So yeah, um, <laughs> if the goal here is have the most money, there is no way possible for him to win. At all. Like, barring some 
absolutely insane miracle. And if he keeps rolling ones on paydays, that ain't gonna happen. And if he keeps setting fires, that ain't gonna happen either. I don't know, maybe it's like every two or three turns of his, I get one turn. Oh, he, he's using his go forward three spaces card. And apparently that... No, no, that was not two or three turns of his, that was one turn of his. So yes, every turn we're getting so much money. Also apparently, yeah, the social security benefits in Japan were apparently crazy awesome. Just sit on my duff and... <laughs> The money just rolls right in. Okay, he's to the end of space now. And Captain T is back again. Come on. This close to the end of the game. Let's get him through the city. Get me all the more cash. Apparently he chose the DDR, or possibly Simon Says, minigame. Yeah, okay, it's like a Simon thing of repeat the buttons. I'll just speed through that. And he apparently succeeded. Go, other guy. Uh, I didn't mean go, other guy, as in... Do it again, other guy. Wait, this is me now. Damn it. Did not realize. Oh, I failed miserably. Oh well, don't care. Doesn't freaking matter. Okay, so now the game actually properly ends. We are both very old. And the demon is back. So hopefully that's not, uh, you know, like the Grim Reaper in some other form. Although, if we go by Yu Yu Hakusho stuff, that could be the Grim Reaper riding on that broom. What was her name? Botan or something? It seems that I'm getting all of these awards, or whatever, except for that one, apparently. And he got another one. <laughs> Nobody won that one. And who wins the Captain T Award? Lord, look at that total! Seriously now! So there's our stats, I suppose. Our money stats, at the very least. What did I just agree to? Did I just agree to play again? I think I just agreed to play again. Just click through here. Now well, maybe this is like a this is your life segment. And his life sucked. And we get credits for having made it through one single game. I, even in a board game style thing, like... If you play Mario Party, you don't get the credits after you play one game. Usually there's 
more to it than that, but apparently... We hit credits! All these characters that we never saw, even. Apparently Captain T was not alone. The whole team. Maybe we should have gone with the alligator as a pet. Maybe more interesting things would have happened. And of course, there's Santa the douchebag in this game. Seriously, like... <laughs> Every time he showed up, terrible things happened. Yeah, I didn't get to comment on it earlier, but seeing in the other screen that snowman is just... chill. <laughs> He's just relaxed as hell. And I don't know why there was a flying butt. I really want to know what the hell is up with that thing. Lips and eyes, and <laughs> nothing else. And yes, bears. <laughs> Cannot forget the bears. There was that one bear attack that happened, and... Sheep are... A thing that can happen. Guess beware the sheep. Fairies! Fairies are a thing that can happen. Hopefully in a good event, and... Class is wearing bunnies! All these things, and babies! All these things that I would hope are good events. And those two again. Okay, end, thin, the end. <laughs> so yes, this has been the game of life. It's incredibly more in-depth than our version of the game of life. I'm honestly quite curious which game of life came first. I don't know if our version is just a severely watered down of their version, or if they took our version and complicated the hell out of it. Oh, okay, ours came first. Good to know. Anyways, <laughs> I, I did not expect to spend this long on this game. So yes, this has been the game of life. It's been Wild ride. <laughs> All sorts of insanity. But yeah. <laughs> We're done here. <laughs>